This video reviews the different types of fossils. Fossils can be placed into different categories. The categories are molds, casts, petrified fossils, carbon films, trace fossils, and preserved remains. A mold fossil is a hollow area in sediment in the shape of an organism or part of an organism. Molds form when the organism is buried in sediment. A trick to remember this is that because a mold is indented, it can hold water. So a mold can hold. Cast fossils are solid copies of, an, of a shape of an organism. Casts are made from molds. Therefore, the cast can fit into the mold. The first image shows a mold on the left and a cast on the right. The second image shows a cast of a plant. The third image shows a mold of a starfish. And the fourth image shows a mold on the left and a cast on the right. Petrified fossils are fossils in which minerals replace all or part of an organism. Eventually, only the minerals are left behind and the minerals look like the organism. For example, many people think that fossils of dinosaurs are actual dinosaur bones. These fossils are actually petrified remains. The dinosaur bones were replaced by minerals. The first image is a petrified tooth. The top right image is a petrified dinosaur fossil. The bottom two images show petrified wood. The Petrified Forest National Park is located in Arizona. Carbon films are fossils that consist of a very thin coating of carbon on rock. When sediment buries an organism, some gases escape from the sediment, leaving behind carbon. After a very, thin, very long period of time, only a thin film of carbon remains. The images on the right and top left are carbon films of plants. The image on the bottom left is a carbon film of an insect. Trace fossils are fossils that provide evidence of the activities of ancient organisms. Trace fossils are also other types of fossils. For an example, an indent of a footprint would be a mold and a trace fossil. Other examples include fossilized trails and burrows. These three fossils show footprints. They are trace fossils, but they are also molds. These two fossils show trail marks or burrows. Preserved remains is, a, is the preservation of the actual organism. This happens when an organism is trapped in tar, tree resin, which is later called amber, or gets frozen. The top three images show organisms preserved in amber. The middle image is from the movie Jurassic Park. In the movie, they use the blood from a mosquito trapped in amber to get dinosaur DNA. The bottom left image shows insects fossilized in tar. The bottom right image shows a frozen woolly mammoth. 